just see just so many colors. And, and this, the one at the top the, I'm trying to get. And the Dilly Dally Desert uh, one is, uh, is similar, but uh, I love the, the brown color, the desert color. Uh -huh. And uh, trying to enhance it with uh, Frit one more time, just different color Frit yeah. and mixing it in. It's just beautiful. It's so unusual. And these are truly one of a kind yes. pieces I, that we're looking at I, all through here. I cannot even possibly come close to duplicating uh, any of these pieces. Uh, glass is so interesting to work with. Many times you don't know what you have until it comes out of the kiln. Yeah. I love this one at the top. Yes. And How do you create the swirls in the glass? Uh, the swirls in the glass are typically created by the manufacturer. Okay. And then I'll go ahead and uh, uh, fuse those. And they, uh, they come out uh, literally different colors uh, depending on the time and temperature that they're in the kiln. Mm -hmm. You have quite a few sold pieces. Yes. Good for you. This is great. That's a beautiful little framed mirror. Again, working with the uh, desert colors there. Uh huh. And more. More columns. Columns. Oh, it's just beautiful. And try to put in the uh, cactus or a, a wine bottle there to. Uh, Oh yeah. Give it a little bit of, of texture because uh, actually that is a, a little 3D. Uh, uh -huh. These also are uh, just what's called the tack fuse. So once I go and complete the column, then I'll go ahead and put it in the kiln one more time with the little uh, small pieces of glass that I've made. Yeah, those are cute. Just a little bit of detail that really offsets them. And then an, another very cute mirror. Again, uh, enhancing that with a dichroic glass. Uh huh. So, how long have you been doing this? Been, uh, taking classes for about five years now. I've oh, taken oh, wow. classes in Georgia and Chicago and California and Kentucky. Uh huh. And we'll be going to another class in uh, June in Georgia. Ah. Well, this is just very, very beautiful and people do need to come down and um, just spend some time at the Mesquite Fine Arts Gallery and see all the things that you have available. Um, and you're usually one of the enter entries in the monthly contest also yes. with some of your other art. and um, Your jewelry is always on sale at the Fine Arts Gallery, I know, because I see it all the time. And, yes. um, but it, I, I've had one of your pieces for over a year and it just wears so well. So I just really enjoy it. So thank you very much, Tom. Yeah, we appreciate it. And um, congratulations on Artist of the Month with the Fine Arts Gallery. Thank you very much. Okay. okay.